Hello children, how are you? Today we are discussing about a small concept that is the unit 3, transportation. There are 10 units in 10th class, nutrition, respiration, transportation, excretion, coordination, reproduction, coordination life process, heredity, our inward and concern, and last one is natural resources. Like that, 10 units are there. And now, today, we are discussing a small and simple concept. That is there, unit 3, page number 66, new textbook. Here, figure number 18, you are seeing the presence of what a figure figure number 18 you are seeing what uh, a, a process and what is the process the, this process is called as uh, transpiration and now I am telling you uh, actually this is an activity we need to do this activity in our school in our school campus so you know what are the steps we need to follow while doing this activity or any activity. So they are number one, aim, metal required, precautions, procedure, observation, conclusion. And this activity we are doing whether the plant or leaves are performing transpiration or not. And today we are discussing this concept. So here first we need to take a potted plant which is well exposed to sunlight and we need to take what a polythene sheet and also thread and we need to tie this polythene sheet by taking a selecting a branch and with the help of a twine or thread after uh, the this polythene sheet is uh, tied with the help of the thread we need to keep the entire setup in the sunlight after some hours, we observed that inside the polythene sheet and uh, attached to the polythene sheet, in the side of the polythene sheet, we observed the presence of what many water droplets. And how these water droplets are formed? And what is the mechanism that is involved in the formation of these uh, water droplets inside the polythene sheet? So here, these are leaves and you see this is the branch and leaves are having what stomata and these branches also having lead cells and they are openings and through this opening what will take place evaporation of water takes place and loss of water takes place and this evaporation of water and uh, through the stomata through the lead cell the water vapor is released and here there is no more uh, uh, entry of these water droplets into the atmosphere and there is a cover, there is a polythene sheet. In the, inside the polythene sheet, these droplets are attached. And this uh, experiment confirmed that plants are performing what? Evaporation process. So here, during the process of evaporation, they are releasing what? Water. And the process of evaporation of water through leaves and lend cells is called transpiration. Once again, I am telling you what is transpiration. The process of evaporation of water through the stomata of the leaves and lend cells of the branches is called transpiration. And this is the simple concept today we discuss. Thank you.